My name is Angeline Kalista and I'm from Jakarta 2023 cohort. And I'm currently doing my social enterprise, working with communities and businesses for waste management. I come from Jakarta. I was born and grew up there. So um, I know that Jakarta is not a perfect city with the, with the traffic uh, and also like people are just, um, it's not walkable and everything, but I grew up there. I built uh, connections and meaningful relationships with uh, the friends, with my family there. So I think um, Jakarta is always a place that I call home, but there are a lot of things that uh, can be improved from the city. And I know that uh, God is calling me to be there too. And yeah, I think that's something that I would continue to do, like seek the welfare of Jakarta. I think RG is actually the answer to my prayer. So um, before IG, I was praying uh, so that I can get a community where I can um, talk to people about my work, about faith and how to integrate it. So I was actually being recommended to RG from a friend who's also an alumni. And I think work is meant for worship, right? Work is meant uh, to serve God. But what does it mean? Uh, I think it, uh, RG d does a very good job in um, trying to set up my identity in Christ when we're filled with our identity and how we're about to go in the marketplace and how we're about to uh, bring the resources that we have uh, to serve other people and to do our work, not just to do for the sake of doing work, but it's actually to serve God. So yeah, I think um, those are the things that I really learned from RG. I always believe that the Jeremiah 1 verse 5 is always a, a verse that is close um, to my heart and what God has been calling me. Like, I believe in that since I was in junior high school. And um, I was experiencing a lot of journey in my career where I need to move from one place to another, where I need to shift career, where I need to let go of the things that I built. And there are a lot of things that is causing me confusion. And I was asking God like, God, why are you doing this? Um, what do you want me to do in my life? And uh, the first from Jeremiah, it's about God knows me since I was, um, before I was born, since I was in my mother's womb. And then he sat me apart and then he chose me to be the spokesman to the nations. And for me, it's just, it just hits me that there, there were dreams in my life where I wanted to be a journalist. I want to work for the United Nations, where I want to be in the media, but God is allowed through all the changes and the challenges that I have to go through. God is actually making, um, showing me my forgotten dreams. And uh, I'm allowed to do those roles uh, in a way that I could never imagine before. And when I on board uh, to my plane to go to GCG, I opened the, the workbook, I opened the booklet and it was about Jeremiah 1 verse 5 and I was like, Wow, God, it's so amazing that, what is it that you're uh, trying to say to me? And like, we're, we've been reading about Jeremiah, we've been reading about identity, about uh, how we need to be uh, filled by the Holy Spirit in order for us to do what we're doing. Um, and we're about to do our mission and about our, how we're about to do our work. So yeah, I think everything is so amazing. And the mentors, the people that I knew from this cohort, they have been such a great support for me. So for Gospel Action Plan, um, for now, my work is within the uh, sector of waste management and also community empowerment. So I think there are a lot of things that I can do uh, to combine both of it. So I think I would continue to um, to work with community. And it's not just working with community to achieve the goal, but to understand what it is that the community needs. because. Uh, we just learned too about human-centered design, about integrating impact to your business. And I think that it's not just about achieving the goals, but really how to love the people, how to love the community. I know that um, if God is speaking to you to join RG, it's, uh, yeah, it's a part of God's plan. It's a part of your journey that I'm sure it will be uh, very beneficial for, for your future and your current and, and your journey with God in the marketplace too.